Hey friends, uh, welcome back. Look what I have. Look at that. Sorry for the light glare, by the way. Um, but looky, 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 looky. Yes, I am a huge, huge Godzilla nerd. I love all things Godzilla. And some of his friends, monster, friend monsters, whatever, they're pretty cool too. But yeah, I'm, I'm a big Godzilla fiend. So I saw this at Walmart and I was just like, oh, wow. Did not expect to find something like this. at. I haven't even seen this on Amazon, although I'm sure it's probably available. But dude, Walmart. And there's the back of it. Look at that, you guys. Look at that. It, it's kind of like parts of it sort of stand up a little bit. But it's it retails for 15 ish. You know, basically 16 with some tax. It was around 13 for me. Um, so it was a, you know, a couple of dollars off of retail, but dude, a Godzilla coloring book. Uh, let's jump into this. Oh, and besides, um, I also have to point out the, the his fins sort of stick up from, they're like raised up from the, um, the book. I, and I think, yeah, his, his claws are too. And these, these parts, this part is raised up. This part is, uh, not this, just right here. And right here right in here and kind of right in here so it's it's sort of oh the Godzilla is is raised up too in places oh wow and this the, the official coloring book that's also raised up all of that oh wow all right let's go oh there you go there's it shows where it's raised up they basically printed it into it wow and the paper is decent. I mean, it's not nothing I would use a ton of wet media on. Um, but you could probably get away with some fine liners. Um, and maybe some distress ink. The paper is, eh, it's not exactly Amazon, but it's, it's somewhere between middle of the road and Amazon. It's, it's kind of somewhere in there. It's, it's not horrible, but it's, you know, it's obviously not like Kirby Rosangood or stuff like that. So that's just to give you a feel for the, the, the paper. Um, now I haven't actually colored in it, so I don't, I can't really say for sure. Um, I just got this book a, about a week ago. So first edition, March, 2024. So it's brand new. Um, Titan books. Yeah, let's see. Uh, it just talks about comic illustrations and so forth. Um, and it's available. Uh, it has a CIP catalog number from the British Library. Wow, wasn't expecting that. Huh. Okay. Anyway, let's go. And there is the big bad boy himself. That is a nice double page. Wow, look at that, you guys. I hope, I hope you can see that pretty well. Oh my goodness. Now, there there was one monster I actually didn't recognize, and I, I was like kind of shocked. And my husband said it was the uh, garbage monster or pollution monster or something like that. Pollution monster, I think. There's Godzilla, and it's a it's a so so drawing of him. Me, I like the Japanese house in the back. That's the turtle. Oh my gosh, I'm having a senior moment i forgot the turtle's name okay y'all drop it in the comments please and remind me uh, uh the turtle with the tur with the, the the little horns on his back and stuff Rem can y'all remind me who that is i forget anyway um there's godzilla doing this thing some of the drawings of him are better than others i love this one personally because it reminds me of the one that he was kind of all bumpy looking um some of the older Godzilla movies he's kind of like that 
and you can see his spikes were definitely different. Um, there's, hmm. I think this is the pollution monster that my husband was talking about. Oh, let me make sure I'm still in focus here. There, sorry about that. Um, I wanted to make sure I didn't go off, off camera. Uh, I think he said that was the pollution monster. Uh, let me know if I'm right, guys. Um, and there's the three-headed hydra. Um, I think that, I think this is Rodan, if I'm not mistaken, right here. Oops, sorry. I think that's Rodan up there. That's a nice, interesting, almost like a Mandela, maybe. Ooh, I think that's supposed to be Mothra. I, I hope I'm getting that right. Sometimes I forget, like, all the monsters' names. I know a few, but I'm more, you know, into Godzilla more than anything else. I do like uh, Mothra and um, the one that looks like a turtle, sort of. Uh, trying to remember his name. Oh, my gosh. Bunch of senior moments. Okay. Um, I don't know about this one. That's kind of strange. I don't like the way they... I'm going to be honest, uh, brutally honest, I'm, I don't like the way they drew him here. It's, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not crazy about that. Um, I love this, though, the, the Hydra. And one of the Hydras is, is like, necked out, you know, M-E-C-H. Oh, that's cool. There's the airplanes. Oh, man. Here's one I haven't seen in freaking... Um, geez, this is one of the really old monsters. Whoa. I have absolutely 100% forgotten the name of this one. Wow. I, I recognize the look, though. I'm going I'm to have to Google it up. But if you guys know, you're, again, you're welcome to... Let me know, because I, to be honest, I can't remember some of their names. Mm. There's a good one. I like that one. Leaning Tower of Pisa. There's a whole interesting story behind that, by the way. Just as an added FYI. Um, there's a, the Hydra again. Yeah, they, there's Mothra, I think. He's spinning his little web stuff. There's the Mech Godzilla. I don't know about that one, but I know that's the, the, the mechanized Godzilla. That King Kong and Godzilla sort of joined forces to get rid of. Whoa. Wow. There's the pollution monster again, I think. I think that's what he and called it pollution monster oh wow <laughs> that's all that is a lot of detail kirby eat your heart out man <laughs> oh this is a good one i like that one this is Mo i think mothra before he changes into the you know the moth or whatever pupils pupa stage something like that Oh, this is good. I like this one. Oops. Make sure I'm still on camera. Wow. That's a good one. Whoa. Wow. That's very interesting. Um, huh. I don't even know what to make of that. That's very interesting. I have to do some studies on, uh, like, uh, see if I can get some reference photos of a close-up of his uh, eye, because that would be very. This has this. It looks deceptively simple, but it's I think really not. Um. Oh yeah, 
There's another one. There, this monster was, geez, he was back. Where is he? Where did we see him? No, hold on. We saw him somewhere else. Where did I see him? Uh, let's see. I know we saw him somewhere. Oh, I forgot. Oh, that's a really good one. I almost went, blew right by that one. That's a really good one. Huh. I'm just, I know I saw him somewhere else. That's weird. Huh. Where? That's weird. I know I've seen him somewhere. There he is. There he is. I think that's the same monster. Oops. Sorry. There's the Hydra again. And they're trying to blow him up. And he's like, nah, nah, not going to happen. I eat, I, I eat new bombs for breakfast. Oh my gosh, look at this. Wow. Well, that, that is a crazy page. I love the way they did the monsters here, though. It's very, obviously, kind of neat. Wow. Oh, look, no more boo-boo. My hand's all better. <laughs> I love it. I had surgery on it, and as you can see, it's it's pretty much all better now. No more, no more uh, lump on my hand to make things painful to hold and whatnot. I'm so happy to have my hand all the way back. Oh, these are good. I like this one. This one's okay. It's definitely comic book like though. Ah, the mecha one. This would be a good one to practice your metal work on, coloring on. There's a couple here like this one. I'm probably gonna scan and print out on like watercolor paper. Because that this would make an excellent watercolor um, picture. Oh, I like the way they did this one. That's cool. That's cool. Hmm. He looks like a tri not a triceratops. Oh my gosh. Um, the bird, the dinosaur bird. <laughs> I'm having such a brain fart. Um, he kind of, he kind of, he kind of looks like that a lot. Oh, it's definitely very comic book like. She doesn't bother me at all. This is good. I like this one a lot. That would again make a good watercolor one. I like this one. This one is dumb. <laughs> I'm just gonna say straight up, this one is dumb. Uh, I don't like it. Um, I mean, some of you guys may like it. I, I personally don't care for this one at all. Um, what I may do is just like color it all in, just color over over the these little mini Godzillas. I'm really not, I don't like that one. That one's cool though. And that's going to happen in color books. You're not going to like every single page. It's, I mean, most books. Oh, I like this one a lot. Good action shot. There's the, the mech one again. Wow. I know some of them are grayscaled a little bit and some are like straight up line art. Oh no, here's my favorite one. Whoa. Yes, indeed. Wow, there we go. I like this one a lot. Now this one would be would be something to color. I would take my time with this one. Love it. And you know the old ones are so cheesy you just can't help but love them. Oh. Interesting. I think that might be it. Oh, look at that version. I don't. I don't think 
think I quite remember this version. Hmm. Maybe it's from the comic book, strictly. Anyway, it says, featuring never-before-seen illustrations, fan-favorite comic artwork. That explains some of the pictures. Fan-favorite comic artwork. There it is. Original pattern pages. Mothra, Rodan, King. I cannot pronounce that. If any of you know how I, I could sound that out, please let me know. But I do recognize the name. I just can't pronounce it. Mecha Godzilla, yeah. And... The King of the Monsters, yep, Mothra, Rodan. Oh wow, this is so good. Most of this is really good. There's a couple pages that I'm just like, eh. <laughs> but the rest of it, yeah, no, this is this is fun. Walmart. Um, I'm sure Amazon has it, but I picked it up for under fifteen dollars at Walmart. <laughs> so I hope you guys really enjoyed that. This is gonna be fun. I think I'm gonna start with Oh, I'll show you guys. I think I'm debating between this one or where's the other one? That's my favorite. Let me. That one's pretty good. Um, what is it? Do -do 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 -do. Hold on. Or this one. I don't know. If, let me know which one you guys think I should start with. I'd be very interested to know. So, but yeah. Under $15 at Walmart, guys. If you're a Godzilla fan, this, this is a must-have. So, have a great week, guys. Bye.